Hey guys, today's gonna be a quick one. We just wanna see how we can adjust the NVIDIA fan speed within Unraid UI. Um, a couple things you're gonna need. You're gonna need the NVIDIA drivers, and the other thing is the um, GPU statistics plugin, both of which can be installed from the community app store. Um, technically, you only need the GPU drivers, uh, but it is helpful to have the GPU statistics plugin so you can see the fan speed in the UI pretty easily, like right there. You can see a bunch of other things too. You're gonna be doing this through the, the shell or terminal within Unraid. I copied and pasted right there. Um, the format is pretty much how I pasted it. Uh, the command is gonna be in the fan control setting and also the fan speed setting. Uh, the fan control setting has to be turned on and then the fan speed setting, you can set it from zero to 100%. And so once I set it, I set it to 40%, for example, now you can see how the fan ramps up to 40%. You can also change it to really whatever percent you want. Uh, let's say we change it to 100%. And you can see how the fan speed slowly ramps up to that 100%, or at least approaches it. As you guys are probably figuring out, this only has a static setting for the uh, fan speed. It doesn't have a, a curve installed to it. If you want to turn it off, um, just set the fan control setting to zero and I'll go back to the default. I'm not really using my GPU right now, so the base setting is going to go back to zero since it's not really in use. And that's how it is. Pretty much that's all there is to it. Um, if you want to be able to do um, this, say, at the startup of the array or every hour, you can install the user scripts plugin um, and just paste the command in there um, and you can run it every hour or at startup or whatever, however you like it. Um, one thing this does not account for is for if you have multiple GPUs. I don't have multiple GPUs in my server, so I can't really stress test it or, or just test it out, honestly. Um, and so I don't know what would happen if you had multiple GPUs. If anyone wants to try it out, go ahead and you can uh, let me know what the results are. Thanks.